five-man United transfer target stances on moving to Old Trafford this summer. Manchester United are set for a busy summer transfer window as new manager Eric Ten Hag starts to rebuild his squad ahead of the 2022-23 season. The Red Devils finished the last campaign in disappointing fashion, winning just three of their final nine matches to end up with their lowest ever Premier League points tally, 58. They missed out on Champions League football in the process and were left in sixth place after their 1-0 final day defeat at Crystal Palace. This means Europa League football awaits United next season, and Ten Hag has a massive task on his hands to steady the ship and take the club back towards the top of the division. The Red Devils have been linked with a number of players, and the former Ajax boss is keen to bolster his ranks as soon as possible. With Nemanja Matic, Paul Pogba, Jesse Lingard and Edinson Cavani all leaving upon the expiry of their contracts, the Red Devils need to freshen up their squad with multiple additions. So, with that in mind, here is a look at the five main reported United targets and their current stances on moving to Old Trafford. The Netherlands international has been tipped to make the switch to Old Trafford with Ten Hag keen to reunite with the midfielder. However, it seems as though De Jong is happy in Barcelona and wants to stay and fight for his place at the Spanish giants alongside Spain duo Gavi and Pedri. He said, I have already said it before, Barcelona are the club of my dreams since I was little. If other clubs call I will take the call, of course. It is something that is always done. United conceded the most goals out of the Premier League's top seven last season, 57, and Ten Hag hopes to bolster the Red Devils' defensive line with at least one new centre back. Timber has been touted as a possible option after the pair worked together at Ajax, and the 20-year-old has not ruled out a move away from Amsterdam this summer. However, he did appear to hint at his desire to continue playing Champions League football, telling Dutch outlet The Telegraph of course I can develop further there with Ajax. I am 100% sure of that. I don't feel like I'm done at the club. But I can also develop at other clubs. In the end, my gut feeling will be the deciding factor over whether to leave or not. The picture has to be right. You can go to a big club. But if you're not going to play there, it's better to stay with Ajax. And Ajax is also a big club. We play football in the Champions League and I play there together with the best players in the Netherlands. That is not nothing. Another Ajax star, Anthony is the latest player to be linked with United after scoring 12 goals in 33 appearances for the Dutch side last term. Liverpool are also interested in the Brazilian winger, and like Timber, Anthony would not say no to leaving the club if the right offer came in. He told The Telegraph, Ajax is the place where I feel happy. But of course I sometimes think about the next step that will come. I think the English and Spanish competitions are wonderful. When the time is right, I hope to be able to play there. When exactly? Only God knows. The highly sought-after Benfica forward is attracting interest from the likes of Arsenal, Newcastle, West Ham and the Red Devils this summer after another scintillating campaign in Portugal. Nunes scored 34 goals in 41 games across all competitions as he won the Primera Liga Golden Boot Award. However, according to RMC Sport, Nunes has already rejected an offer from United. The Red Devils reportedly claimed they would be willing to pay £67.8 million to sign the Uruguayan, but he is not interested in a move to Old Trafford as he wants to join a club who will be in the Champions League next term. Ten Hag is targeting at least two new midfielders in the transfer window and ideally wants to sign a defensive-minded anchor man and an attack-minded player. Leeds Phillips has been subject to interest from United to play in the deeper position after impressing for club and country over the past two seasons. But given the rivalry between the two clubs, Phillips is keen to stay in West Yorkshire. He told BBC Radio Leeds back in March, I've made what I want to do clear. I've made my intentions clear. I want to be at Leeds and I'll focus on that until my contract ends. I'm not really worried about it too much. It's always been something I've been confident about sorting whenever it needs sorting. There's always going to be noise when you're an England international and you're playing for one of the biggest teams in the country, and I think until the end of the season, I'll be happy at Leeds and always will be.